All right, guys, we just got to Devil's Den. Take a look at the sign. Pretty cool entrance, so we're going to go snorkel here, and we're going to go check this place out. Are you scared, Bryce? No. No? Rye, are you scared? Boy, oh, she's giving the devil's look because we're at the devil's den. Give me that mean look. Urgh. <laughs> this place is pretty. Um, I think that's the cave right there to the right. And we just got in. We got our wristbands here, but we need to change into our Bana suits. David and Christy have already went down, and Braley's already gone down to, to check it out. We're just going to walk over here and see if we can see the inside of it from the top. Hey, Bryce, we'll go this way, Bryce. Let's go this way. Let's go see if we can see it. Hey, there's Shannon. Oh. <laughs> I just hit the sign. Shannon's getting ready to go down with me. There is the entrance to the Devil's Den. This place is pretty cool. Bryce, we can't go down there yet. Come on. Let's walk this way. We got to get our snorkeling gear before we go in down there. Look at this hole. Man, this thing is pretty steep. You can hear people talking down there. Oh, I don't know if you can really see down there. Come on, let's go over here, guys. Oh, well, there you go. You can see Christy. Hey, Braley. Yo, hey, up here. Oh, it's cold. Is it cold? Cool deal. There's Christy and everybody up right there. There's Dave. Hey, Dave. Oh, can y'all see down there? Look at that. It's pretty cool, huh? You want to go swimming in there? Yeah. Yeah. No, they, they won't let you bring your floaties in there. But we're about to get our snorkeling gear on and we're gonna head down there and snorkel around. All right, guys, we are going into the devil's den. Watch your head. Pretty cool. <laughs> Okay. All right. Oh, so this is going to be a light kid sitting on the stairs? That's fine. Just keep so going. Whenever you get a just keep here. walking. Okay. Well, no, you're good. You're good. I'm waiting on them right there. Getting. <laughs> Man, you can tell it's like... 20 degrees cooler in here. It's like 90 degrees up there. It's probably comfortable 70s in here. The whole water is pretty cold. Right. I think it's going to be one of those things that we just have to jump into to get used to the water. <laughs> hey, Braley, stand, you and Mom stand right here and I'll get a um, little shot of y'all. Get a little picture of y'all. Alright, let's get in the water. This is pretty cool looking. I caught a fish. 
man. This place is pretty cool, man. Not very big, but it is some definitely a gorgeous scenery. It's really not too crowded right now. A lot of people came in real early, but uh, I'm guessing every devil's den, there's a light shining through. And you can see it penetrating through all the way down in the water. Shane is snorkeling. And devils. Snorkeling and devils then. Alright, let's go back. Let's go back underwater and check out some of the underwater sites. So we just swam all the way around it. Um, the cave is located, I think at these two buoys here. See these buoys. Um, they have a sign right by the cave that warns people about cave diving um, and the deaths that are associated with cave diving. But you could hang out here all day. Uh, especially when it's 90 degrees out and check out this cave it's freaking awesome glad we did it Shannon yeah. hey Dad, yeah. I got a really good picture spot if you want to do if you want to take a picture you want to take a picture yeah all right hold on guys we just left homestead florida and we are headed down to marathon florida forgot where we were going for a second florida guys florida we're going to florida keys Yay. so yesterday we hit up devil's den and it was pretty good i'll say the biggest wow factor when you go into devil's den is right when you walk in i think that is like the wow factor like holy cow this place is pretty the water was not as clear as jenny springs Rayleigh, you agree? Water's not as clear as Jenny Springs? Well, I think it was as clear, but it was just really dark due to the lack of lighting. Due to the lack of lighting. That might be true, yeah. Uh, and Shannon did a little bit of snorkeling, and Raleigh and Bryce were not able to go down there just because Devil's Den does not allow floats. Uh, so if you have little ones, you're going to have to either swap them out with a person in your party or um, they don't have to go down there without floats. Also, you, al you also have to have snorkeling gear to get in there or dive gear. They don't let you just go in there and swim. But we are headed to Marathon, Florida, and hopefully we catch like a big tarpon. Like That's what I really want to do. I really want to catch a big tarpon. You want to catch a big fish, Bryce? Bryce wants to go fishing. Uh, Shannon wants to do a little bit of snorkeling. Uh, so we're probably going to do some of that too, a little bit of sandbar too. Alright guys, well, we'll see you on the water. Alright, we have made it to Marathon Key and we are out on our first sandbar. Look at how pretty this is guys. We've got some clear water, we've got beers in our hands. We're not going to be doing any fishing today, but I'm going to walk over there and hit up that little sandbar right there. But it's pretty cool out here. It's first time being out here um, in our boat. 
But this is beautiful. Braley's going ahead and getting her snorkeling gear on. She's gonna snorkel a little bit right here in the grass. Can't close it. Oh, see, I told you she talks to me with attitude, you know? She doesn't think she does talk to me with attitude, but now I have proof. I have proof that my daughter talks to me with attitude. You don't want to post that anymore. Oh, I'm so gonna post it. I am definitely gonna post it. I'm gonna say, look, Braley, you said that you don't talk to me with attitude, but you do talk to me with attitude. All right, so I gotta help her close this up, get her in the water. I gotta get a beer in my hand, and we're just gonna enjoy the sun, guys. Look, yeah, Bryce can. just learned how to snorkel. <laughs> he saw this clear water. Look at you doing it, man. Go, Good show job, me. Bryce. Show me. There you go. Show me. Go on. Do it. Uh, also, you want your mask? Of course you would. <laughs> of course you would want your mask right when I sit down. <coughs> All right, let's come, we'll come fix it. Come on. You got some water. Yeah, I think you got water. This is beautiful. Look at this shallow water. I mean, man, this is like being in the Bahamas, but at the Keys. Holy cow, man. I need to do this more often. It is roughly about wrist deep. <laughs> That's about six inches. Let's take a look over here. See if we see any fish. This water on this side actually looks a little deeper. deeper it's just more grass over here yeah, it's getting about knee deep waist deep snorkel in this area oh look at that it's a little sea turtle up there you see that in the water is that a sea turtle or a stingray it's a stingray that stingray in the water man this beach is beautiful and i think for the rest of the day all we're going to do is hang out here for a little bit longer and then we're going to go check into our hotel and unpack everything really enjoy devil's den and jenny springs and i'm looking forward to hanging out here and doing some tarpon fishing maybe get offshore it looks like it's going to be calm this week so we might better get offshore to the humps and catch some blackfin tuna actually when we came and parked our boat we saw three big tarpon right up on the sandbar and i was like oh man I'll get my fishing pole but nothing was out and ready to go so i wasn't able to throw to them but i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and we'll see you on the water guys look at this we were washing the boat and we got a surprise it's a manatee she is loving this fresh water. Way to start off our key vacation. There's Matt Dunn and Robert. Hello oh, guys. Nice little boat you got there. Manatee. Manatee. <laughs> and there she goes. Come back, I think she's been hit by a boat. Got a couple of scars on her. Ooh, one one scar is pretty fresh. That is pretty cool though.
Yeah, I, thought, I thought they were too. <laughs> I mean, look how big she is, though. Yeah. She, <laughs> it looks like she's on vacation, just enjoying the fresh water. Alright, well, we're going to finish cleaning up the boat, and it looks like she had her fill of water. And she's headed on. That was pretty cool, wasn't it, bro? Yeah. Way to start off the key vacation at Marathon, Florida. Oh, you turn it off? All right.